business office. Cosmetic. Not that useful, I guess. Lipstick, lip gloss, compact, glitter. Note. Huh. Faith, thanks for covering for me tonight. Let's talk before you go over to the apartment. Lily. Looks like they both saw one of Lily's clients. Chubby. Chub. Nothing. Excuse me. I should check that thing. I heard you out there. I don't remember ever seeing you here before. I keep hearing that. Somebody else said that to me on the way in. I guess we're all surprised. Lost cat again. You're trying to place me. They used to call me the Little Mermaid. Once upon a time. Does that help? What do they call you now? Whatever makes them happy. My name is Nerissa. Well, Nerissa, I've got some questions. Of course you do. I don't have answers. You'll have to find those yourself. Mr. Smith? I need to know about one of Lily's uh, clients. Calling himself Mr. Smith, apparently. We can't talk about work. This is a murder case. I mean, can't. These lips are sealed. Discretion is our guarantee. It's how things People are keep here. saying that. I hate that. People keep using those phrases. What does it mean? This is what I need to know about. Lily's last entry. Who's Mr. Smith? Where's room 207? I have to know. These lips. Sheriff Wolf, would you like to make an appointment with me? What are you suggesting? What exactly are you suggesting? We could make all the usual arrangements, the usual place. Oh. Uh -huh. I see. What would I need to do? I need 150. It's not good to be short. Um. Okay. Oh, I. I should take it. Wait here for a second. Oh really? I can't even pay for a hooker. Shit. Not two oh seven? You'll think of something. The open arms. Hmm. This is where they met. Enjoy your stay. I hope you find what you're looking for.
rooms or anything like the lobby. They should cut their rates. Want it by the hour or for the whole night? Beauty. Oh, uh, I work here, okay? I work the front desk. It's to help pay rent. So, now you know. I know I should have told somebody, but the beast would I was his mind if you knew. Well, your secret's safe with me, all right? Let's not make a big thing of it. Thanks, Bigby. And thanks for covering for me last time, too. Sure. So, no big what deal. are you doing here? Oh, you have a key. Someone else was murdered last night. I heard. The victim was someone who worked at the Pudding and Pie. Lily. She, uh, come around here ever? Oh. Oh, yes. The, the troll. I did see her. I mean, you know, we never really spoke, but she came off a tad intimidating. I was a little bit better. You see Lily I was that bad. Maybe on a job. Sometimes, but nobody I've recognized. I haven't worked here that long, though. How about a room register? Or someone named Mr. Smith? <laughs> That's all we get here. Smiths, Jones, or Johnsons. I think the last ones are jokes. I was just no Have you seen Snow White down here? Or maybe somebody glamoured as her. You know, it's funny. I did see someone who I thought looked a lot like her, but... She didn't say anything when she saw me, even though she knew that I saw her. I just assumed it wasn't snow and went about my business. You know Tweedledee? I talked to Tweedledee earlier today. He mentioned you in passing. Do you know him or his brother? I took out a loan for back pay. It was like our third notice. And ever since then, those annoying freaks have been pestering me for the money plus interest. Why take out a loan from those two? It was from the crooked man. Huh. Beauty. Crooked you don't know how man. desperate I was, Bigby. I had nowhere else to go. Look, if this ever happens again, come see me or Snow first, alright? I tried. Sorry. Let's ask all the questions. Girl named Faith? Or just maybe hear that name? I might have. I don't know. By the end of the night, it's, it's kind of a blur with all the names. Tara, Brandy, Amber, Heather... Sorry. Thanks. Wait. It'll be better if anyone sees you, that they at least see you with me, so they know that I didn't let you just wander around by yourself. Five minutes, please. We'll see, beauty. Just be ready to act like I'm trying to kick you out. That won't be hard. Listen, Bigby. I assume you'll be filing some kind of an official report or something. Which is fine, it's just that I was wondering if I no, could be in it. I Do you have to mention my name? No problem, I've always let me. Ever seen yeah. Report. It's just... Don't worry about it. Less I have to write down the better. Thanks. I appreciate it. Well, here we are. Which one was it? Oh seven seven. I'm not gonna make some shit over and out every doors. I'm gonna save some time for my video. Why the hell am I knocking? Just open the free door. You have keys to these rooms? I thought you had a key. Not to this one. Hold on, Bigby. I can't just let you go into any room you want. Seriously, what if Please. I could get into a lot of trouble? Please. <sighs> it's only a day. Well, that's weird. This key is supposed to open every room in the building, but it's not working. Beauty! Shit. Why are you here? How could you do this to me? No, sweetie, no. Wait a minute. 
How could you do this? We've been together through everything. I took care of you. I love- It's not what you think. Please. You're cheating on me? With him? No, no, Beast. I promise I'm not. I'm helping him. That's all. I'll bet. I'm sure you have- I'm on a case. This is a murder investigation. She's helping me- Stop lying He's not me. even listening. What the fuck is wrong with you? She's my wife. Beast, listen to me. There's nothing going on. I'm mad. <laughs> I finally see you for who you are! Stop! Stop it! You told me you hadn't seen her, you fucking liar! You've been sleeping with her this whole time! I don't want to hurt you, so just calm down and- Beast! Calm down, please. Oh shit, I- Damn it, I never- I spat the that. Okay, I'm so sorry. Now I'm ready. I'm sorry to do this, but you can dodge. Sorry. I really don't want to bite you, man. Sorry. Sorry. I didn't mean to do that. In the game. Do that. Enough. 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 Come on. Ready. Blood everywhere. Shit, Bigby. What have you done? What? What is this? Bigby. Look what you did to the door. You can't just act like this whenever Stand you. Stand back. You you don't want to see this. Oh my. Shit. 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 What is it? <gasps> Don't touch it. Is this is this Lily met her client here? Mr. Smith, whoever he is. And then must have happened. He, right he here. Jesus. Jesus. Last night? Yeah. I was on shift last night. On shift? Beauty. What? I'm not a prostitute, you idiot. I work the front desk. Do you remember who rented this room last night? I don't think anyone did. Not last night. Maybe they have it long term. I don't know. How am I supposed to know? It just seemed like a totally normal night. How is that even possible? There's so much blood. Go lock the front door. Keep people out of the hallway. I need you to be sure no one comes in here. This is a crime scene, okay? But just do what he says. I'll explain later, okay? Bigby. What kind of a person could do something like this? That's exactly what I'm about to try to find out. Just a player. I can't believe this. Do all the rooms have these same clocks with the built-in cassette player? I think so, yes. It's the same. Really? Where'd you get that? Lily had it in her hand. There was any doubt over who died here. We shouldn't even be in here. Let's check one by one. Beautiful. What is that? It's a book about Snow White. Or about the Monday version of her story, anyway. The shit. The whole book is about her? Yeah. Why is she she's in the dead. coffin? This is the part where she's in a deep sleep, but they think she's dead. 
You don't know the story about Snow White, really? What's it mean? Why mark the page where she's sleeping? I think he made up the bed to match the coffin in the picture. Flowers too. He'd have had Lily lie down just like this. You mean just before? In the story, that's when someone comes to kiss her. That's our Mr. Smith. This is creepy. The coffin and, and a weird fixation on snow. What the hell is wrong with this guy? Back out. That's true. It's a huffin' puff. I thought you were the only one who smoked that crap brand. Apparently not. He brought wine. Classy. Yes, sir. Yeah, let's play it in the cassette player. I saw Snow White. The what it's called costume, I guess. Someone's been rough with this dress. It's torn. Oh no. no. She must have been wearing it. He killed her and then and then he took it back off. No, there's no blood on it. Must have been torn some other time. This is the same dress as the one in the book about snow. I think Smith was dressing Lily up in it to recreate the snow from the book. You're right. It's the same dress. It fits. He's acting out scenes from the book. That poor girl. She couldn't have known. She probably just needed the money. She could have been anyone. How did she wind up here? I mean, we can't really here, know. But just how does a person? We can't know the answer to that. Every situation is different. I got a cassette. Yeah. Let's put it in there. What the? Big beat this? I think I heard this music last night. It was playing pretty loudly for a while and then stopped in the middle. I didn't think twice about it at the time. I, I mean, you hear all kinds of things around here and I guess I've already gotten used to blocking them out. Would have covered up the sound of the murder. I need to see it coming. Is there anything else you can tell me about last night? Anything that sticks out in your mind? Sorry, no, it just seemed like every other night does. That's exactly what's bothering me. From now on, I'll just be down there imagining this. How can I find out who rented this room? Find whoever has the key? I'm pretty sure this one must be held long term. And we don't keep a register or anything. This place is intentionally kind of anonymous. I keep hearing that. She's no nothing. Is there anything I miss miss out? Oh that that come on, I can't. Smell something? No. Eat an apple. Eat apple. <laughs> huh. Oh no, there's more? What? What now? It's like the apple in the book. It's got a single bite taken out of it, like in Snow's story. Oh no, do you think it was poisoned? It wasn't. I'd have smelled that. I think it's just a prop. It's here because they were acting out the scene in the book. Of course, that makes perfect sense. He's just acting out another part of the book. God, I can see the whole picture now. It, it all goes together like you said. This creep put that girl in a snow white dress and, and recreated the whole story from the book with the apple and, and the deep sleep and everything. You're a better detective than I thought you'd be. Thanks. So he planned it all out. 
he had all the details noted down. Only then, when it comes time to kiss her and wake her up. Yeah. I hope you're just about through. I don't really so want to do stay any longer. There's something down there. Grab it, envelope. No, it's no. How do you know? I'm in this one. It was taken last winter. Oh no, Bigby. This kind of stalking, it doesn't just stop by itself. Trust me, I know about this firsthand. He'll keep trying to get closer and closer. His stand-in for Snow is gone now, so... The next step closer. What is it? It's <gasps> rain. What the hell? It's great. Dun dun dun. Next time on the book among us, it's end of episode two so fast. He could be after you now. Good. I am dying to get my hands on that disgusting weasel. Obviously, there will have to be some changes. GGD or dumb, I don't even know. Take care of it, Big B, or I'll take care of it for you. Jesus Christ, Big B. Is that you? Shit got intense. How did you respond to Crane about Snow's dead? Simply. Okay, fine, never mind. How do you treat a model suspect? Most of the decisions are correct, I guess. Do you keep punching? No, obviously not. I think that's all for episode 2. Thank you for watching. Leave a like if you enjoy. I mean, hope you enjoy. And thanks for watching. Goodbye.